Hi. There is a whole lot of excitement going on. So we are going now on a little trip and I'm very excited. And I am going to make some stuff for us to have on the way because this is going to be a long drive. It's going to be about 11 hours that we're going to be driving. So I'm going to make all kinds of stuff that we can eat on the way. And I'm going to show you. Your shop because there's a whole lot of stuff going on here. So um, I every morning I make my uh, morning shake. So what I do is I mix in into my coconut milk. I'm, I'm mixing this one and this one. I put some almonds in it. I put some uh, seeds and nuts and stuff. I guess I don't even have it all here. And then I take these, because you know we all need that. And I take it out of the, it's in a plastic thing, and I open the plastic and I dump it in the shake. So I'm going to take this shake with me because I, I usually always use this one, but we're not traveling with that. Then we have a little bit of snack here with us. So I have boiled some eggs. I'm going to make some eggs and cucumber sandwiches for breakfast. And then we're going to have oranges and water that's for breakfast then for lunch i have already made some chicken let me show you i have already cooked some chicken here i'm going to um cut that all down i'm gonna put some sun-dried tomatoes in it i have some rice and i just have to think about i'll add something to it and i'm gonna make like a lettuce wrap and that's gonna be for lunch and then I am making some classic yellow gluten-free cake with some icing probably that we're gonna have for dessert. Okay, let me show you. Got the rice ready. And look at here, this is the excitement. And we decided to have strawberry icing on it. I'll show you when it's done. So I want to tell you what I decided to do. So this here is going to be my icing. So <clears throat> I had a whole lot of um, raspberries. I had some raspberries and they were about to be ruined. And I had a whole lot of um, strawberries. So I decided, let me mix that up in my blender and try and put some, uh, what do you call it, powdered sugar? So I did that, mixed that together, but it was so runny. So I thought, let's try to put a little bit of corn starch in it. Corn starch in it. So I did that, and since you, if you put it in and you heat it up, the corn starch, it's gonna make everything go a little bit thicker. So that's what we're working on now. It tastes good. I think I'm gonna put just like one, two drops of vanilla flavor in it. And then hopefully that goes, th it becomes thicker because this is mighty thin. And I'm gonna take it off now, the heat. And I'm going to let it sit and see what happens. Okay, dokie, I'll let you all see. Okay, dokie. Now we have that weird looking strawberry icing. But it tastes good. I tasted it and it tastes pretty good. So it melts half over in and but we have to taste it. I know I was gonna take it to uh, the trip. I was just gonna take it and I'm gonna cut it down. And just I think just take it like this, put it in a cooler, but we have to taste it. So let's taste like a little piece right here. And it got thicker. It did thicken thicken up. Let me see. I'm trying to do it with one hand. Look at that. Let's see, let's see. <laughs> I, got, I got water in my mouth. Let's just use some fingers. Let's see. Oh boy, oh boy. Mmm. You can never go wrong with a cake. Look. Mmm. You can never go wrong. 
It's actually because it's not so overpowerly like fake sugar tasting something. It tastes pretty good. Mm -hmm. We're gonna eat it. So I did my um, wrap mix. And this is chicken, rice, dried tomatoes, spiced tofu. I think that's it. Let me see. And, and bell peppers, orange bell peppers. And your spices and stuff. And then we wrap it up. And I made a dip for it actually, which is soya sauce, crushed uh, garlic, a whole lot, and ginger root chopped down in it.